So this is take one of hopefully many more if I get onto MasterChef. But uh, so I'm the roasted dad, if you can follow me on Instagram. And this was my son that I just showed you now. He's Aiden and then my wife, Liana. And somewhere around the house is another little one running around. And we've still got a third one on its way. So three, three children, dad who loves cooking, also an entrepreneur. And I'm going to have to move because I've only got two minutes. So I'm going to hand over the camera to my wife. So today, basically, I'm cooking a pork belly. Um, that takes about two days because you basically got to dry out the pork to make sure that the crackling is really nice and hard and crispy. And the way you do that is you score it, you put it in the fridge overnight um, with lots of salt and pepper. And you make sure that that dries out, gets all the moisture out of the fat. Next thing, three hours in the oven, 160 degrees um, in a water bath, but basically making sure that you never touch the fat with the, the liquid. I had rosemary, black peppercorns um, in the bath in those three hours. I've also put together a, um, a basic red cabbage with balsamic vinegar to bring in an acid into the dish. And with that, I've got sweet potato medallions that have been done in some honey and salt to bring some awesome flavor together. And with that, I'm going to be serving um, green candied figs as well. And roasted dad. Roasted dad, hey. Mm. Do you like roasted dad, my boy? Mm. And one of the stranger things that I like doing on a dish is actually um, lettuce. Yeah. So it's baby lettuce that has been grilled really high heat. So I do it on the fire. If you go look at my Instagram, you'll see that I've done it a couple of times on the fire. And you basically just throw lots of um, salt and pepper and olive oil onto your dish onto your um, lettuce and you throw it on, on hot hot coals or even on a grilled pan like I did tonight um, and basically you get this really really nice sweet flavor I've got some candied figs to go along instead of apple which is more of a traditional pork conversation that everyone has and as I said pork on top of the balsamic vinegar reduced uh, red cabbage did you just try some of that my boy and this is basically a corn puree, and the corn puree adds some nice color. Let's see, I messed on that a little bit. Hey, what did you say, Benny? Roasted dad. dad, that's right. And that's my, the pork belly with lettuce, candied sweet potatoes, red cabbage with balsamic vinegar, and I also got some wild mushrooms on there.